ओम शांति वेलकम टू नाइन्थ ऑफ जनवरी स्कॉल यू बसिंग सुप्रीम फादर वॉन्ट्स अस टू डू सर्विस बट वाई डूइंग सर्विस दे शुड बी ट्रुथ एंड एट द सेम टाइम दे शुड बी लव बैलेंस ऑफ लव एंड द अथॉरिटी ऑफ ट्रुथ बिकॉज इफ यू हैव द अथॉरिटी ऑफ ट्रुथ बट इफ यू हैव ईगो अलॉन्ग विद दैट दैन इट्स गोइंग टू नॉट इफेक्ट पीपल रादर दे फील बैड अबाउट इट सो मे यू बिकम एन एम्बॉडीमेंट ऑफ सक्सेस बाय बैलेंसिंग योर लव विद योर अथॉरिटी ऑफ ट्रुथ you saw in this world of falsehood <clears throat> the practical form of the authority of truth is father brahma in this falsehood world which god is calling as kali yuga he said the practical form of the authority of truth is father brahma father brahma had the knowledge because he received the knowledge from the supreme creator shiv baba and at the same time he had humility with him his words of authority never gave him a feeling of having ego see his words of authority had love merged in them they always He used to always call, "Bache, bache, come, I'll make you understand." So it was not out of ego. His words of authority were not just filled with love, but they made an impact. So follow the father. Love and authority both have to have a balance. Humility and greatness. Love and authority. Humility and greatness. These let these pairs of virtues be visible equally. Love and authority. Humility and greatness it has to have a balance so humility is there love is also there authority is also there you know the truth this is right but there is a method of sharing it with others not out of ego not by laughing at others let these pairs of virtues be visible equally now underline this balance in the service you do and you will become an embodiment of success and that is what godfather wants us to do he wants us to serve humanity with a lot of love with a lot of humility whereas in the world if you see if you go to take knowledge from somebody that person will be authoritative obviously but also have a little bit of ego and if that is the imbalance then we will always feel feel lower than that person but god never wants you to feel lower than him he wants us to feel that as if we are his own children we have the authority and also have the humility just like god has whereas human beings once they get the knowledge they have the ego and humility is something which goes far away that's what happened to ravan right and we don't have to become a ravan we have to become a brahman so that's the difference a brahman is someone who has the knowledge of all the shastras given by god directly he doesn't have to read the shastras given by god directly he knows brahma baba he knows how he has become brahman and at the same time he has so much of humility along with authority and love for human souls so this is what we learn in brahma kumaris to learn more about it do visit the brahma kumaris center Om Shanti